हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी विल स्टडी अबाउट द रेडियो एक्टिव इक्विलिब्रियम व्हाट इज इक्विलिब्रियम लेट मी कंसीडर दिस डिसइंटीग्रेशन सीरीज इन दिस सीरीज अ कंपाउंड रेडियो एक्टिव एलिमेंट ए इज डिकेइंग टू बी एंड दिस इज डिकेइंग टू सी एंड दिस सी इज डिकेइंग टू डी एंड सो ऑन सो आफ्टर ए सम टाइम वी गेट अ कंडीशन that the rate of decomposing of each element becomes equal it means that the number of atoms of each element becomes constant suppose after time t the number of atoms of a becomes na the number of atoms of b becomes nb the number of atoms of c becomes nc and the number of atoms of d becomes nd so the rate of disappearing of each element becomes equal this condition is known as equilibrium condition so the rate of all disappearing will be equal so minus dna upon dt will be equal to minus dnb upon dt this will be equal to minus dnc upon dt and this will be equal to minus dnd upon dt here a negative sign is imposed because the concentration of each element is decreasing but the rate of disappearing of each element depends upon the number of atoms of this present at that time so minus dna upon dt will be equal to lambda i n a where lambda is the disintegration constant for the radioactive element a and n a is the number of atoms of the a we can also put k instead of lambda here the minus dnb upon dt will be equal to lambda b upon nb lambda b into nb minus dnc upon dt will be equal to lambda c into nb and minus dnd upon dt will be equal to lambda c nc so from these equation we can write that lambda a na is equal to lambda b nb is equal to lambda c nc and is equal to lambda d nd so the number of atoms na upon nb will be equal to lambda b upon lambda i from this equation we can see that the number of atoms of a or any radioactive element is inversely proportional to its disintegration constant but we also know that disintegration constant is inversely proportional to its half life so the number of atoms of each element will be directly proportional to its half life so greater the half life greater will be the number of atoms of that element the radioactive equilibrium is of two types first is secular equilibrium in this type of equilibrium the half life of parent nucleide is many much times greater than that of the daughter it may be by a factor of 10 raised to the power 4 or more than it for example we can see this disintegration series this is a uranium disintegration series in this uranium is converting to thorium and thorium is converting to some other substance in this case uranium is parent atom parent atom and its half life is 4.5 into 10 raised to the power 9 years and thorium is the daughter nucleide and its half life is 24.1 days so there is difference much more than we can think so this is a type of secular equilibrium for secular equilibrium the number of atoms of b is given by n b is equal to lambda a upon lambda b n a 0 e raised to the power minus lambda a t next equilibrium is transient equilibrium in this type of equilibrium the half life of parent and daughter nucleides differs by a very small factor for example we can see the thorium disintegration series in this series thorium is the parent atom and palladium is the daughter nucleide the the rate for the the half life for the thorium is 24.1 days while that for palladium is 1.18 minutes so this is in days this is in minute this is not a much difference so this is called a transient equilibrium the number of atoms here is given by nv is equal to 
लैमडा ए अपॉन लैमडा ए माइनस लैमडा बी एन जीरो ई रेस टू दी पावर माइनस लैमडा ए टी तो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट द रेडियो एक्टिव इक्विलिब्रियम सेक्युलर एंड ट्रांजियंट इक्विलिब्रियम इन नेक्स्ट वीडियो वी विल कंसर्न मोर थिंग्स थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग दीडियो